New tonight, snowbirds are here and many more are on the way. Yeah, but where will they live? As Fox 35's Dave Puglisi shows us, finding homes may be harder than ever this year. This lifeguard stand welcomes you to Margaritaville. The community has become one of the most sought after for snowbirds. Those lucky enough to get in say it's worth the wait. This is such a change of life. Richard and Missy Huff have found the sunshine and palm trees that adorn Central Florida more their style. Living in Margaritaville is like doing an all-inclusive every day of your life. The upstate New York couple landed their dream home in Latitude Margaritaville and Daytona Beach. Realtors say the 55 and up community has become one of the most sought after destinations in the area. Wiseau Homes Realty has sold 59 homes in Margaritaville this year, which nearly matches the number they've sold over the last three. Where the people are coming from, the Northeast, cold weather areas, um, but also, you know, Tennessee and Kentucky. Let's not forget our friends north of the border. That's opening up to Margaritaville representatives say residents could wait up to a year for their home to be built, and they're not the only community with a wait. There's not, not enough houses for the amount of demand that we have right now. Realtors point to the national supply chain shortage for part of the housing backup. Less supplies simply slowing construction of homes. On top of that, realtors say snowbirds are coming sooner than in years past and are willing to rent longer while they wait to purchase a home and they want to be down here. They're excited about it. So like, you know, we'll just rent for six months or 12 months until our house is ready because they want to be here. I think here in central Florida, it's a little bit, uh, it, it, it's a little bit more seasonal. Um, we're not seeing them as much, but we are seeing them. Realtors agree that it's still a good time to buy a home while interest rates remain low. They say even with the supply chain shortage, the number of houses on the market continues to outpace the demand. In Daytona Beach, Dave Puglisi, Fox 35 News. Well, a partial